So we're tracking a nor'easter, a little spring nor'easter on the way here. I know, some rain, some wind, a little bit of snow. I know, it's May, but we are talking about some wet snow mixing in with elevation across central and western Massachusetts here. This is not going to be an overly strong nor'easter. It's a pretty fast moving one as well. Cool temps will linger through the middle part of the week as well, and then 60s will return by Thursday. Early weekend outlook, never too early to start looking ahead. Looks mainly dry and mild with temperatures 65 to 70 on both Saturday and Sunday, so that's something to look forward to. All right, onshore wind right now. Temperatures running in the 40s out the door. We'll rise into the 50s by later on today. A lot of clouds in place, but a touch of sunshine early this morning as it comes up in the next 10 minutes or so, and then back to the west, we're tracking rain. Some energy coming out of the Great Lakes, some rain down through the mid-Atlantic. This is going to develop into a coastal storm and pass south and east of Nantucket overnight tonight and early tomorrow morning. So let's time out the chances for rain. This morning we're dry, this afternoon we are dry, then it's late in the day, generally between about 3 and 4 o'clock, that some rain develops in western Mass and western Connecticut. This will continue to advance east towards the tail end of the evening commute. By 8 p.m., it's raining in a lot of spots, and it's a steady rain with some locally heavy downpours as well. Notice the blue on the map. So right around or just before midnight, we start to mix with some wet snowflakes. The temperatures will be above freezing, though. So uh, I do anticipate a little bit of accumulation on grassy surfaces, but the road should be okay. Again, this is overnight tonight. We see some wet flakes early pre-dawn tomorrow. Steady rain wrapping up between about 5 and 6 a.m. tomorrow. 8 o'clock, still some leftover showers, but overall, the steadiest rain will fall overnight tonight with just a lingering pop-up shower tomorrow afternoon. So how much rain is going to fall? For most of us, it's less than an inch. I'd put a half an inch to an inch for most of us from the Cape to Boston. There may be a few locally higher totals when you get north and west of town that may see over an inch in some of the heavier downpours. All right, snowfall forecast. I know it's May, but this is not unheard of, obviously. Grassy surfaces, we'll be talking about accumulation. Elevation dependent, too. That is key, especially above about 1,000 feet, 1,500 feet. That's where we may see a coating to much, as much as an inch. Could be a few inches, though, with the high terrain of the Berkshires in southern Vermont and then back up along Route 89 in western New Hampshire as well. All right, highs today, dry this morning and afternoon, 50 to 55 for most, so about 10 degrees below average for this time of the year. Areas of rain tonight, the wet flakes mixing in in the hills. Overnight low about 42 in Boston. Colder, obviously, in Central Mass. Tomorrow, we don't get out of the 40s. It's going to be chilly and raw. Any early morning rain ends will be a spotty shower in the afternoon. And then Wednesday, some improvement. 55 to 60. I do anticipate some breaks of sunshine on Wednesday. Thursday is really the day we start to see some improvement, though. A brighter day, mid 60s for the end of the week, too. Chance of a shower by Friday and 65 to 70 for both Saturday and Sunday.